you can calm you can calm down, mate. I'm in a public space in a free country. Go tell the cops. They'll tell you the same thing, mate. Yeah, good. They said they were going to call the cops on me for filming in a public space, and I said, why are you wasting their time? I want to actually ask you one Why aren't you vegan? Why are you still eating out of places like this? All right, so we're just walking up to this slaughterhouse here. This is Moy Park. It's a chicken slaughterhouse owned by Pilgrim's Pride. And I'm uh, just going to see if any activists are here, and I'm going to go bear witness to the chickens. Hey, guys. How are you doing? Hey, mate. Hi, yeah. Good to see you. Hello. How are you? Usually, they have to have the gas tank connected to the chamber. Yeah. I'm just going to go down and uh, look to see if the gas chamber is over here for these chickens. Look at those big cylinders. Hey, go, mate. I was just saying, what are those cylinders? They look like feed cylinders. Which one is the gas? Is this gas? Second day? Yeah. <laughs> Don't know nothing. <laughs> Lemo there? Oh. Oh yeah, on you. Oh here. Just on the phone. Trying to find out which one's the gas where's the gas? cylinders. What they do is they do controlled atmosphere stunning and um, they, they take them straight off the truck in their crates, stick them straight in this big like, like a big fridge thing that just gasses them. Outside. Huh? Outside. Excuse me mate? Outside. I can film wherever I want. Oh uh, that's public footpath and that's on the footpath then. That's, you can calm. Property. You can calm down, mate. I'm in a public space in a free country. No, that's it. That's an inquiries desk. Yeah, but this and there's is right of access here. This is private property. You I'm not. Come on here. Have I jumped the fence? It doesn't matter. There's public right of access here. You well, don't know you anything. What you talk about? I'm, I'm filming for years. I know exactly what I'm doing. I couldn't care less what are, you're doing, are you the police? Oh, I'll ring the police. Get them down here. They'll tell you the same the thing. No, they won't. This, this is a public walkway. This isn't public. This is a car park. It isn't public. There is right of access here. There's and no this fence. Isn't a car park. All right, call the cops then. Call them. Waste their time. Get offside. Get off our property. Waste their time. Get off Who cares? Our property. Why do you care? Because I work for this company. Who cares? What? Why do you care if I'm here with the camera? Where's the gas chamber? Whereabouts is the gas What's chamber? What's it got to do with you? I want to know where they're gassing the chickens. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. It's got nothing to do with you. Yeah, yeah, it does. Everything no, to do with me. It. Yeah, I'm a. Do you work for my park. It's got nothing to do with you. It's, it's, it's in the public interest. No, it isn't. Yeah, it is. They, 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 uh, this isn't. is con they're consumers. They want to know where their animals it's are being killed. Nothing to do with you. Yeah, I'm a member of the public. It doesn't matter. You don't work for my park. Yeah, but it's a matter of public interest. I'm allowed to film it here isn't. if I want. I'll get in touch with my park then. Yeah, well, you said you work for them. I do work. And you're for their them. spokesman telling me what to do. I'm telling you. You're taking a position of authority I'm here. I'm telling you, you cannot film. Are you the, are you the boss here? It doesn't matter. Then why do you care? It's full of shit, mate. Why do you care? You're full of shit. shit. You're full of shit. Why do you care? It's a camera. You can't come on. It's a food processing property. place. People don't act like this at. Uh... All right, then what about if I walked in your house? Is this, is this your house? What about if I walked in your house? Is this your house? Don't talk do you live stupid. here? Where's your shower? Where's don't your bath? Talk it's a It's a job where there's food. It's a uh, meat pla packing place. It's not really my house, is it? What, what I want to know is why they care so much about a camera at a meat uh, processing facility. It's a food processing facility. Of course I would care if you're in my house. I'm not in his house. It's a public street in a car park. But he's acting like, like I've got to be worried about filming in public or something in the UK. Just because it's a slaughterhouse doesn't mean they have some type of like legal privilege over everyone else. It's an inquiries desk here. I'm here making an inquiry. Like, silly. But who are Moy Park? So Moy Park is one of the UK's top 15 food companies. It's Northern Ireland's largest private sector business and one of Europe's leading poultry producers. They have about 590 broiler chicken farms and have 35 million birds on the ground at any one time. And they kill 6 million chickens a week in this country alone. They've even worked with celebrities like Jamie Oliver. On their website, it says Moy Park consider it a moral duty to prevent the unnecessary suffering of animals. And we are proud to now be the largest producer of indoor higher welfare birds 
in the UK. An undercover investigation has been released today, which animal equality claims shows chickens being neglected and in distress at farms operated by Moy Park. But not surprisingly, they've been extensively exposed for animal cruelty by both Animal Equality in 2019 and Viva in 2021. According to Animal Equality, Moy Park supplies major retailers like Tesco, Sainsbury's, Co-op, Ocado and McDonald's. So it makes sense they don't want any activists around with cameras walking around filming. Film the transportation trucks, the fridge trucks. There's a carbon dioxide cylinder there. But I wonder if that's for refrigeration. Public space, mate, public space. It's just silly, like, why act like, like you're a police officer anyway when I'm, it's England, you can film whatever you want. Especially when there's public access right like this. All right, let's keep, let's move on. Pilgrims own Moy Park, so. Ah, okay, there's a truck arrived. Ah. Uh. Oh, this is so hard to actually see them, eh? So where did that, that, so that truck just went around there. Let's follow it actually. So I couldn't see the, the chickens actually because they have like these covers over them, but they looked, they actually looked really terrible, like from what I could see. But I think they take them around here. They're complaining we're filming, but it's the UK, so we can film. This is a public walkway. Um, we're gonna go see where the truck went actually. So they own this as well truck containers over there as well. There's not much to see here. So it looks like it's like a, it's like a three stage processing plant. Here's the uh, truck full of chickens. Yeah, they're in there. They drive them down there, they weigh them. That's where they take them. Yeah, there, 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 there. Come on, come on, come on. I don't care. It's a, it's a free country, I can film where I want. We're just uh, legally filming actually in front of the slaughterhouse. We've got, there's a public footpath here. So we're just staying on that. Um, and we're just waiting for these chickens to be unloaded so we can film it. They said the police are coming, but so we're not doing anything wrong. Like, so I don't know why they're acting like we're doing something wrong. So yeah, so it goes through down there. Can you see it? So it looks like that's where they did do the, the killing. Back there. And there is a big white kind of um, cylinder thing on the side of that building there. I'm not sure what those big, two big tanks are. Could be for waste, they turn blood and stuff into fertilizer, I don't know. So at least we know where the, the gas chamber is. They kill them over here, and then they do the processing over here. Packing, things like that, looks like. So they might even cr create the products in there from the chicken straight away. And there's a reception there, and you can see it's the European Division of, of Pilgrims. And that's because um, Pilgrims is actually a US company, I'm pretty sure. So. Here's another one. Film this guy, babe. Film this guy. Or just, uh, he's yelling at us for filming or something. There's a lot of workers over here, but... They might actually work on the kill floor, so... Do you all work here? Do you all work here at Mui? Yeah. yeah. Do you work on the kill floor or in the pro... Sorry, bud? Is this the kill floor here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was looking. There's a pr there's like three, one, two, three. Uh, from uh, expedition. Ah, okay. This is where they go. They put them in the truck. The yeah. meat in the truck. Yeah. yeah. And the gassing's over the back. They put them in the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. How long you worked here for? Long? Five years. Five years. You know, it's a long time. But not on the kill floor with the blood and that. No, no, no. no. Okay. Maybe not five years if you were on the kill. <laughs> Yeah. Stinks a bit here like the chickens and that. A little bit. No, it's coming only 
Only the produce. I, know, I didn't know this was here, actually. Do they make like them? Legs, like wings, like everything. They make it frozen product, like yeah, uh, schnitzel yeah, yeah, and yeah. stuff. Yeah, because I see them in the store actually. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah okay. So are you contractors or you work for the company? Con so contract. Company, company. You, you work for the company. Yeah. You're a contractor. You think they'll give me a tour? Give me a tour. <laughs> no. <laughs> Maybe. I don't care. Yeah, because I've never seen inside the. Uh, you can't go in inside. In the gas. No, no, no. I know. No worries, Buzz. Seem like nice lads. But he worked here for five years and not on the kill floor. So that's what I, that's what I mean about slaughterhouses. They're all car compartmentalized. Most people will be completely disconnected from the kill floor and they can, you know, there's so many different com uh, departments here. You know, meat packing and, you know, transport and things like this, and maintenance. A lot of people don't even see, like when you think of a slaughterhouse worker, you probably just think, oh, they're, they're on, on the kill floor slashing chickens' throats and, and abusing animals. But these days, it'll be a truck, crates full of chickens. Someone will come with a forklift, put those chickens straight into a gas chamber, shut the door, press a button, that's it. Then they get the, them stunned chickens out and then they'll pros process them. So they're really not dealing with live animals all that much. It's all automated and uh, it's all completely disconnected from most of the workers here. Who knows, they're probably so disconnected from the slaughter process, they probably eat a lot of the products out of here because, you know, why would it disgust you if you never really see the process, but... Hey, mate. Hello, you all right? Good, mate. How's it going? Yeah, good. They said they were going to call the cops on me for filming yeah. in a public space, and I said, why are you wasting their time? That's what we thought, but hey, hey, we are. Yeah, so we're walking on the public uh, land here. Yeah. He had a go at me over there, where there's an inquiries desk. Yeah, yeah. There's no fence there, it's just... Yeah. Public land, yeah. inquiries desk, and I was standing there. Yeah. And uh, we, then we were filming actually over here, the footpath goes around there, and sure. we're filming through the fence. And uh, he just got really angry. I said, Look, we're in England, I'm yeah. just legally filming whatever I can see in public, and uh, wasn't, yeah, that's what you can do. Uh, wasn't trespassing. He said, no. What if I was at your house? I said, Look, mate, there's implied right of access, there's no fence here, yeah. it's a f yeah. public footpath. I wasn't walking around snooping behind fences with signs there. Yeah. And uh, yeah. yeah, that's it. But uh, otherwise, we're just uh, filming this chicken slaughterhouse here. They kill a million chickens a week yeah. in a gas chamber here. They come in about six weeks old. Factory farmed. Most yeah. over 90% here are factory farmed. And uh, little little baby animals. How long are you stopping the trucks for when they come? Uh, three minutes they allow for, yeah, which is nice of them. They don't always want to. Yeah. Some people don't want to, but I'm just going to go film these animals. Did you want to come and have a look? Oh, I thought with you, mate. I know, no, no, I know my, I know my right to film. I wasn't, um, I wasn't going to get myself in trouble, but he didn't. I don't. Maybe you can tell him if he wants to talk to you, like about filming laws. No, no, the guy that had a go. Yeah. No, he. I asked him if he was security. Just a guy on a on a um, crane who thought he was security. I asked, are you security? But he was acting like um, he was. But these little birds. What do you want to tell the viewers? What's the worst thing you've seen here before? Because you've been coming here for a while. We've seen dead birds. Um, birds yep. with lacerations. Yeah. Um, loads of sore fur, feathers missing. Um, yeah. But you see, I saw the backs of them out. Yeah, so actually. Ammonia burn. And that's because uh, all the feces and that they're constantly living on. Just burns their little their little chests, and uh, they can fall over because of the um, weight on their little bodies. They grow so quick, actually, that their um, their little bodies can't support their weight, and they end up falling over in the sheds. They're living in their own feces, and little infants suffering the entire time, basically, of their life, all to go into these processed chicken products and chicken breasts and legs. Absolutely sickening. Absolutely sickening. I think yeah. we'll probably go shortly. Obviously, I'm not going to remind you all this stuff because you know it all anyway. Yeah, yeah, I mean, there's security cameras here. Yeah. I mean, if they want to film us to make sure we're doing the right thing, they're yeah. welcome to because it's a free country, eh? Hey? I mean, are you filming? Yeah, yeah. You know, you're supposed to tell us before you come up filming. It's in your uh, 
isn't it, in your yeah, manual? It's in the policy. Yeah, it you're is, supposed yeah. to tell us. We don't I have to tell you because you're yeah. actually a public servant. We're allowed to yeah. film you. Yeah. So, yeah. and you got your name tag here. Yeah, 15033. You're supposed to actually identify yeah. yourself before you address the public as well. Actually, I come up and address you, but, yeah. but that's all right. I don't care, though. No. I'm just saying. No, you're you're very friendly. You're actually a all the time, you know. You're a very friendly, yeah. You're a good, good. What's your channel called? YouTube. Me. I've seen you before. Yeah. Trying to get information out of me, or you're genuinely one of those? No, just genuine. Because uh, <laughs> the friendly question. officers I are usually. I can't yeah. Kind of place you, that's all. Nah, yeah, just Joey Carbstrong. You address the public really well, actually. Just, you're, you're very I just friendly. I like to talk to people. That's all I'm here for. A lot of people don't quite understand what's behind the scenes, do they? What's no, going on no, actually, they don't. And uh, I didn't as well. I used to eat chickens all the time, and it's one of the most disgusting things to me now because yeah. I've been yeah, seeing a lot of these places they're all the same they always come in looking like terrible everyone thinks they buy from these humane farms yet yeah, statistically most animals are factory farmed here in the UK but so if everyone's buying from these humane farms yeah. Yeah, yeah. who's making up the the demand for the factory farms that they just don't they don't know because they see the labels and they don't see we're allowed to continue filming yeah, yeah, oh, cool. yeah, yeah. thanks yeah. that's good to know no, you're all peaceful there's absolutely no problems from our side yeah, no. you've suddenly started scaling the walls or doing random things from <laughs> trying to I trespass deliberately. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're, they, they don't want us in there, so we're not going to try to walk through. Um, yeah, obviously if you start going in there and stuff, then... They yeah, should bring all the meat eaters through and show them how the chickens get yeah, gassed and gutted, should. you know? Yeah, uh, well, it's important that people out, should know like what happens behind the scenes world. sometimes, isn't it? Because I think we are quite a closed-off society. So all people see a label, so... Yeah, and right, I'll just go tell my colleagues here. Well, no worries. Like, you know, he said they should. people should see the process. What's the matter, mate? Sorry? Sorry, bud? So hopefully uh, the police are going to go tell the slaughterhouse staff that actually as long as we're on public property, we're allowed to film. This is a slaughterhouse. It's in the public interest to know about this place because they're serving meat to the public, actually. Make an educated decision instead of just looking at labels all the time. Just just legal behaviour, what we're doing right now. Don't ever let any slaughterhouse people, or, or anyone really, tell you you can't engage in legal behaviour. Yep, we're filming, mate. <laughs> filming in public, <laughs> it's a free country. They act like we can't film in a public space. Public should know about these places here, actually, so they know they exist, so they know there exist big, massive gas chambers operating, killing little baby birds that have suffered their entire lives. The public go in a supermarket, they pay for something that they, they believe that it's, these animals have been treated well. They believe that everything is, here's, here it is here. They believe that these animals have come from a nice place. They haven't, statistically. And uh, look at these little babies. Look at him. No mercy. Straight into a big gas chamber. Yeah, film the film the chickens. Film the chickens. Just stay on the public footpath, all right? Use your zoom lens. What's your problem? It's a public space, mate. This is a public space. No, it's not. That's a footpath. No, it's not. Go tell the cops then. That's a footpath. Go tell the cops. They'll tell you the same thing, mate. This is a footpath. Hey, buddy. No, we're not trespassing, we're just uh, staying on the footpath. Sorry, mate. Me. No worries, brother. <laughs> Too easy, buddy. I'm glad, I'm glad you're not paranoid. <laughs> Some people here are paranoid about us filming, I mean. We're staying on public, we're just looking at the chickens. That's all we're worried about. We're not worried about anyone here, just the chickens, that's it. No worries, brother. Yeah, I was just gonna say, like, some people, they take their, their job a little too seriously. Like, you know, you get some people who are more chill about everything, got nothing to hide kind of thing, relaxed. And you get other people who try to be very authoritarian, like uh, acting as if he has more authority than he does. Police are coming back now, so did you let them know? Let them know which bit? Did you let them know about the, f that we're allowed to film as long as we're not yeah, trespassing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, because I actually yeah, we, was just, we just talked to the security. We've told them that you can film in a public space. Yeah. Um, 
you know, they, they've asked you to stop, but we said you can film as much as you want in public space, like, you know. Yeah, but um, we're, we're, so we're going to shoot off now anyway, I think. So all right. You're not doing anything wrong. You got any questions for us before we leave? I want to actually ask there. you one Why aren't you vegan? Why are you still eating out of places like this? You know, you, know. this place exists because of people that, like me, there's, there's who was eating out of there for a long time. Yeah. It, it's disgusting, this place, you know. I am very lazy. Yeah. I've got a lot of friends that are vegan. I've got a lot of vegetarian friends. Yeah. I used to live with a vegan and vegetarian. So oh, cool. I ate very healthily when I was at uni. Yeah. They cooked all the time. But oh, cool. Well, I there's some good, if you look around in the supermarkets, you'll yeah. find a lot of vegan stuff these days. And you can be I guaranteed. Could, I could probably imagine vegetarian. I can manage that. Okay. Vegan's probably another step. We'll go um, step by step, but uh, that's it, yeah. <laughs> step by step. <laughs> we'll try. Just it. Step away from this factory farm. Chickens getting gas chambered first. Yeah. Then, you know. Well, in all fairness, yeah, I, I, I wouldn't dare uh, buy from these guys, but you know, it's. Uh, Most people step, think that say. they they have the same advertising as the people you buy from. That's true. Ninety yeah. over ninety-five percent of the chickens are factory farmed here in the UK, and people just don't know because they're advertised to. Well, that's yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a difficult one. Well, not not difficult, but you know what I mean. Yeah. It's, uh, it's to you're a consumer, so, so they'll tell you that this is all good. Yeah. Um, but we know what goes on because statistically, it's factory farms and gas chambers. Which um, which organisation are you guys with? Are you? Is it just yourself on a YouTube? No, no, yeah, I'm just by myself, not that's with an organisation. I was just wondering if you're like specifically to somebody. Well, I'm an independent animal <laughs> advocate. <laughs> just uh, yeah. yeah, that's, that's all. Fine, Do a lot of advocacy, talking to people. Most people are against horrible stuff. Mm. They just don't realise that. Yeah. They're paying yeah. for it. Because they trick people with their propaganda and their marketing oh. to consumers. <laughs> well, marketing, uh, yeah, so that's a different story. Sorry. Green grass and, <laughs> you know, humane, high welfare standards in the UK, but it's all a load of uh, marketing. That's it, yeah, yeah. So it's all money at the end of the day. It's all money. Yeah. Stop <laughs> giving it to them. No, they were, really, they were actually really nice, genuine police. Who's making that noise? Hello, darling. Who's making that sound? Why is your foot there? Is she crushed on there? It's okay, darling. Oh, look at the backside there. Oh, God. Disgusting what they do to these birds. All red and raw. Must be in so much pain. Now they get to escape this horrible life they've been forced into. Going into that gas chamber. Get these little babies away from human beings, you know, they're gonna escape this world. Mate, hey. You like murdering animals there? Uh, just a hero saying that he had a burger. For, he's going to go home and eat burgers now. Will, will Macho, just a genuine hero to me like, and the world. Uh, you're going to go deliberately pay for animals to be stabbed in the throat and killed because uh, some vegans are out here that care about it? Uh, haven't, I haven't, actually haven't heard that one before. A million, billion, trillion times. Yeah, so this is the slaughterhouse fence actually, and this is how ironic that is, that they were just 
going off about us filming in public. They are filming us all over this slaughterhouse. There's cameras pointing uh, out onto the footpath for people just walking past, walking their dogs. There's a camera up here. There's um, CCTV cameras pointing out to the street for cars driving past. So this slaughterhouse actually is filming everything around it. Like all the people just, without their permission as well, actually. But you know what, it's fine because you can legally film in the UK in public. They've, they've got a right to film in public, it's fine. But when we come out here with our cameras, there's a massive double standard. We can't, we can't film for some reason, which is crazy. Um, but yeah, it's okay for them to film us, record us. It's on 24 hour record, go into a hard drive, all of our images, people just walking past with their dogs and families. They can film who they want. As soon as you bring a camera here though, they just lose the plot. Oh, what are you doing? You can't film here, mate. You can't film here.